Stavros! What's Stavros! Up, Yay! Hey, guys. So, nice to see you. We, I don't know how much you love magic, and I don't know how much you love sentimental <laughs> assholes, but boy, oh boy, did you come by yeah. the fire on the right day. I love them both. Well, you, you can't see this, but the pit poster behind me is of a child's magician that I went to see in Greece on mushrooms. Uh, oh, while no. on vacation this week. Yeah, yeah, last, last, last month. Really? Yes. Wait, so last month? In. Yeah, dude, I was in Greece uh, right before the tour started. The Prince of Pleasure tour shouts out. Yeah, everybody, come and get your fucking tickets. Uh, Danny plugged it right <laughs> up top. We're going. We're going to Denver. We're going to Omaha, Minneapolis. You name it. But before that, I had a little R and R over in the motherland, and uh, I just we saw me and my boys saw a poster for this guy named Sankara. Uh, okay. And he and he was he was like, yeah, it's the it's it's like it, he was really billed as like, you know, you can see behind me, he's got handcuffs. He's got like a long ponytail. He's like, you know, and we were like, oh, this is going to be the sickest magic show. We took a bunch of mushrooms on the beach all day. We're having realizations. I'm like, damn, bro, everything is fucking connected. You know, and I'm just yeah. swimming and mushrooms. And then we're like, let's go see some illusions. And it turns out it was just a child's magician. And he was just oh. doing a lot of like, he was just doing, we're the only people there without children. We're just like, oh, like no, what's the man? He's got your old man. And he's going like, look, the rings are connected. Now they're not connected. You guys are like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Are you kidding? I started weeping. Uh, I was like, I've seen God. <laughs> I've, seen, I've seen God and he scares me. <laughs> this man has yeah. powers. He has yeah. powers. Yeah, we this were saying how awesome. powerful. It would be so funny if we go there and he's just like levitating and just the kids' eyes just go black and they're like, you're watching Sankara. And we're like, oh! Sa- Sankara. You talk to your father and you're like, he did it. You didn't go see Sankara, did you? <laughs> You brought the evil home with your son. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so yes, yeah, I'm he, he, then your dad your dad opens up some crazy old leather book and shows you weird drawings of Sankara. Yeah. <laughs> some say he comes in the form of a man. Some say a serpent. <laughs> ah, Join me while we read the incantation <laughs> with our family of Sankara's <laughs> magic. Oh, yeah. We I must ask. Hands. The, <laughs> I must ask the children. <laughs> I must ask the children to leave the room. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you better <laughs> you better pray to Saint Feta Cheese that this oh. is not too far gone. Your yeah. your God Taziki does what does he do for you now? The only way to reverse it is to is to overdose a uh, gypsy with Taziki. Just fill him full of yogurt <laughs> yeah. until, until he explodes. Yogurt dill. Yeah, yeah we, <laughs> and then we Sankara call that, will be banished we, we into call the Turkish gi- dimension. Yeah, we call that gypsy <laughs> ragoon. <laughs> yeah, dill. Dill is the garlic for uh, Greek vampires. <laughs> yeah. Greek vampires. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Sir. Oh so, man, yeah, well, I'm all in. <laughs> All right, well, well, I love it's a gratuitous way for me to say I'm in on magic. I love I magic love very much. The guy who won a couple years ago, that Shin Lim, the Asian dude, phenomenal up close magic. Mm. And, and and this guy that's on America's Got Talent now, I've watched his third performance last night, and okay. I am in on his magic, just his unique take on magic. He's a is to tell you. Uh, an emotional thing about his life within the story of magic and so basically to to give an example like he has two adopted kids they're both brothers he got them each one like separately he was able oh, to wow. get the other one which said it's a nice story him and his wife they're yeah. young they're both super attractive mm-hmm. and they uh they have this life and it's all great but his magic like the first time was Using the uh, the judges and everything to randomly pick things that became like the date that it was official he had his kid adopted, uh, and then the second uh, one was some kind of thing like that again about the say this one's all about his fucking uh, wife and I'm sick of his family and I'm sick of his long ass story magic yeah. get to yeah. it man it's I'm with crazy. you Jay I'm with yeah. you Jay I don't want heartwarming magic I want two Stop gay it. guys and a tiger. I want, yeah. I, want, I want them to be mauled potentially, or I want a hot lady and her tits might pop out when she's getting sawed. That's Titties what I might want. pop out, but I want to see things like, I just like, I'm a sucker for like the quick thing. Like, remember when David Blaine would go and like smack a, a fucking deck of cards against a beer bottle and the deck would be in the bottle? Like, that's the stuff <laughs> yeah. I fucking like. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Or like, 
or like throwing cards in the air and like chucking a knife and it hits the the right card like shit like this thing yeah. where it's like look at you have successfully picked out the day that I proposed to my wife and they show the video of him pro- like getting married it's just like suck my dick dude just do magic you fucking pretty Thank asshole you. Be Thank down you. with the devil and make stuff appear, dude. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's satanic. That's what I want. I want to yeah, dance with want... the devil. Yeah, I don't want to be with God. I don't want a guy this, bettering he's himself. Christian magic. They had a guy. What if I told like... you <laughs> they had a the guy love that... of Jesus was always <laughs> in you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, dude, you like the positive, like the po- team positivity bodybuilders who like rip phone books yeah. in half and shit? Yeah. And he goes, and that, my friend, was Job. Yeah, out of the whale. <laughs> dude, they fucking uh, they got rid of a guy this year already who came out. The voice was all over the loudspeakers. He never actually talked, but it was like uh, and it was sort of like the saw voice. But he had like mm. he had some cloth like mask he wore over his face that made him like a Rorschach thing, like mm. from Watchmen, where it would like yes. as he breathed on it, it would like change like to black and and come back to gray. It was pretty awesome and pretty good magic. And that was all like evil, and you know, of course, then the problem is like. Fucking uh, Heidi Klum is like, he's too scared. And then, like, you know, Sophia <laughs> yeah. Vergara is like, ay, Santa Oh, like, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Exactly. Like they're too, stu- they're, 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 too stu- they're too stupid for, like, magic that can be, like, put under the guise of, like, isn't this fun and creepy? Like, right, it always right, has right. to be. They love that it's like, oh, do you have to adopt more kids now to make a new trick? Like, he's yeah. out of shit. <laughs> yeah, magic's gone soft. Cancel culture's oh, gone to magic too. Are you kidding me? That's right. You can't, have a, you can't have a big tit fucking girl popping out of a That's thing anymore. Crazy. Now nah, I'm now no I'm what. a First Amendment guy, dude. For that, they've taken our big titted uh, assistants. Sign yeah. me up, dude. I'm t- I'm, yeah. I'm 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 at the fucking capital if that was if that was the issue. Yeah, I'm, Teller, I'm storming it, dude. Teller Teller's gonna be the sexiest assistant in magic. Yeah. yeah, no way, dude. Don't take your sex out of magic. No, fuck that, dude. <laughs> yeah, keep the sex in magic. I would I follow a one issue voter. I go to a town hall meeting at the next presidential election. How do you feel about big ass titties getting sawed in half, uh, Mr. Uh, Vice President Harris? <laughs> Dude, even Piff the Magic Dragon, who has a dog in his act, and him yeah. still has a big, huge titted uh, chick with him. I think it's his wife. Yeah. With yeah, the tear respect. It's a tear tall thing. I think Amazing Jonathan, yeah. like any, did, did Amazing Jonathan, any girlfriend he had would become this this uh, assistant chick. Yeah, that's pretty respect. awesome. Where you're like Co- cost cutting second. measures. By yeah. your second date, you're like, how down he's, with the dark arts are you? He's the yeah. Louis J. Go- he's the Louis J. Gomez of magic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, every girl. Your chick has a job, dude. <laughs> she could walk in unemployed. She has a job by the end of the yeah. week. Yeah. It's a smart yeah. move. No, oh, yeah. Louis should sure. run. Louis should run the unemployment office. Just a bunch <laughs> of poor people waiting to suck him off. For, for Only bread. hot chicks get jobs. <laughs> yeah. It's like, yeah, it looks like a it looks like an eighties music video when you walk yeah. in and you're like, why are all these women in red heels? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like little suits, little half suits. <laughs> Louis's office door always has a bunch of fog coming out of it. When <laughs> yeah. it. Always, I'm here to see. And I'm fog. here to see. I'm here to see Bambi, Natasha. <laughs> <laughs> you know, About a, yeah, Louis, he, he, Louis J. Gomez, headhunter. <laughs> yeah. Wow. It, it's always his sunglasses down. Doggy. Got it. The position yeah. is filled. <laughs> Do bow, bow. Oh. Doggy. But instead, it's him going, sexy. <laughs> yeah. Doggy. Who <laughs> bow, bow. Oh, hell yeah, dog. Oh, hell baby yeah. James. Do bow, bow, bow. bow. <laughs> Yeah. Let's get his son in the family business. Yeah. <laughs> James doing magic drinks. <laughs> it's a le- it's 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 a legacy, dude. Yeah. Uh, well, let's watch. The- I want to watch this corny ass. Oh, it's so. Jacob, this is going to make you want to punch. I know you. Oh, God. I hate him already. Prayer oh. hands. He's got youth pastor say, energy. He dude. talks with a lot. He talks with a lot of prayer hands. Yeah. Goes, so when my life, yeah. my, my my life wasn't always great. I had rough times. You probably don't believe us, but I had rough times. Yeah, you know, it's crazy. He looks like Justin Bieber's priest. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like a he really does. <laughs> my, I think my best trick was making Demi Lovato believe in Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> that was my greatest gift. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Also, a question: 
What's up, guys? He also has them like hand things over to each other, the judges. What is the purpose of them sitting six feet apart if they're going to just hand things to each other? Oh, uh, COVID buster. I'm just arguing. Here, I'm just making the point that why don't they just sit closer together then, like they normally yeah. do? Yep. Eh, I'm whatever. with you, Jay. How you guys doing? <laughs> so good to be back. Look at those oh. eyebrow slices, dude. Oh. Why can't I first? <laughs> I want them. I want those eyebrow slices bad. <laughs> can't no do way, it. dude. I won't do it. No, I won't Hell accept yeah, it. I won't. Yeah, I don't want it enough. Bro, don't don't want it enough. Don't want it enough to feel the the pain of what's going to happen when I show up with it. But uh, <laughs> no, those vanilla in. ices, dude. If you show up with those vanilla ices, I'll get you before you can go to Skanks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, no, I know you would. No, no, I don't have to go to Bonfire first, always, and it's gonna be, it's gonna be there. And then I just, I'll know be as supportive money. as I can be, but eyebrow slices, I can't do it. No, you shouldn't. Nor should you draw you. the line at eyebrow slice. Yeah, a couple eyebrow slices. Oh, I, I, Dan, I think also a Z in my side of my head would also probably have be a conversation. That would be the fact sick. that this guy's not going to spin on his head blows my mind. Yeah. <laughs> nope, dude. He's just going to be handsome with a fucking... Yeah. Go ahead. This yeah. guy looks like he's going to be like, yeah, you know, I've been through adversity. I beat a couple statutory rape cases. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's kind of- <laughs> they had me jammed up in court for the better part of two years. <laughs> you know, when you were a club promoter, you see some crazy stuff. <laughs> they're supposed to show ID to get in. It's not yeah. my fault. Yeah. I told them if they're underage, why are they in a club? I said, you wanted to meet the DJ. I thought you was 22. Now, Heidi, I'm going to need you to pick any number from, let's say, 18 and over. Yeah, how's this guy? If you showed me this picture and you're like, what is this guy doing on America's Got Talent? I'd be like, three card Monty. He does three card yeah. Monty. Oh, really? I'd be saying spoken word poetry. A spoken word oh, poet yes. won last year. What? I, don't know I what remember the that. Fuck you, I don't know what the fuck you did. Yeah, but it was the times we were in because he gave like, it was right. good, like Black Lives Matter poetry and shit. But, uh, I gotcha. And so he just That's won, but, it, that was smart. It's a, but it's a, it's a half ass win. But I'll tell you what, they've been giving wins to acts that can't carry a, a Vegas show for so many years in a row now. They've done the smartest thing. I think I told you this, Dan, already. Now it's a review. It's the AGT review is what you'll be a part of. Uh, smart. 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 They're actually smart for that. Then you, you can have. A, then you can have a, a a child ukulele singer songwriter in there because yeah, because they only can go back to their songs. House. Yeah, she can go back to the townhouse. Townhouse she's staying in in Henderson and get her schooling done. <laughs> That's <laughs> right. Come back like, fuck hey, hey, honey, we're moving to Vegas for those two ukulele songs. You're working <laughs> seven nights a week. <laughs> you, are gonna, you are gonna be busting your ass. But I found a pretty decent place in Green Valley. He goes. So, does, she well, get, does she ever get to play? He goes. Well, there's no matinee on Monday. So yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a couple hours on Monday. Yeah, there's a, one of the Cirque du Soleil kids comes by and they kick a ball around. But, uh... <laughs> one of the acrobat weirdos. Uh, we have that that wolf boy who plays uh, the violin. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All her friends uh, are French Canadian gymnasts. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, why, but why must you leave right now? We are doing our. You are missing. You are missing are Cirque du Soleil. We are doing the fall of leaves. Also known as le long francis de l'enfant. It's a fall. It's also known as le francis de l'enfant. Dustin Tavella. Good magician. Got a credit for Chris, too. But Let's get it. it. I was going through some pretty tough times. I knew it. Yes. But Carrie always made it a point to remind me why she fell in love with me. Oh, and she would boy. send cards and she would leave notes just Pause. to let me know that you she believed in me. You don't think that would... You don't think that would get annoying if you were down on your luck and your wife kept reminding you she was in love with you? You're like, all right. <laughs> yeah, all right. I fucking got it, dude. I got it. I got to fill out this seasonal target application right now. Can you give me a second. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what? Pulling bunnies ain't paying the bills. So you're going to have to let me work this way through this online application, please. I mean, dude, where do you open mic these fucking long... Emotional right, bits, yeah, for a woman that regrets telling you she loves you so much. Yeah, even she, she's definitely rolling her eyes at this in the back of the stage. Somebody goes, she would always let me know how much yeah. I still meant to her. She in the over to time. She's like, oh my she goes, Christ, our neighbors God. sucked them off, and I caught them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I mean yeah. that's what it is for sure. Yeah, he, goes, he was getting blown by Fat Rita in four B. Yeah. She's all just right. getting stuffed by all the Jabberwockies backstage. While <laughs> <doing this. laughs> 
<laughs> She's like, have you ever had... They're fucking her rhythmically. Because <laughs> you ever been DP'd by guys in blank masks? It's odd. <laughs> <laughs> She's getting plowed out to extraordinarily loud Kendrick Lamar songs. <laughs> yeah. All right, and you've got to understand something about my wife. She supported me, man. When I couldn't make the magic happen, uh, uh, she believe. did. <laughs> she was there. She adopted me two beautiful baby boys. I had a hammer incident. I was working on a construction site, and I broke open one of my testicles. <laughs> she put it back together. <laughs> it was 18 weeks of bed rest. She did everything for me. She would hold my ball back while I would pee. It's she still had, That's why I sound like I'm in pain every sentence uh, I say still. <laughs> every move I make, my somehow my... My larynx is connected to my testicles, and I swear words. to God, I can't believe your nuts must be attached to everything. But that I digress. And when I my laugh. wife loves me, <laughs> and she would send cards and she would leave notes just to let me know that she believed in me, no matter what. Judges, I want you to think of someone in your life who makes you feel seen. Ugh. Could be a spouse. Pause it. A friend, a mentor, scene. A child. Put it on the list. Put it on the list go. with the word journey. Mm, uh, with taking, someone taking a journey and being feeling seen or feeling unseen. I'm putting it on a list of th- of things we got to burn down. It's over. I don't want to hear it. I, I love feel that. seen. The, his his energy is like it's half like motivational speaker, half theater kid. It's yes. like one of the worst, oh, one of the most unholy yeah. alliances. You got to understand that when I was growing up in the barrio, I didn't have a chance. <laughs> yeah. I didn't have a real. <laughs> you know He's got Danny. This guy is he can't sing, dude. <laughs> He's, he yeah. does. He has Danny Hawk energy. And here's the yeah. thing. I bet he can sing and I bet he can dance pretty good too. You're, you're, you're absolutely right. He is a theater right. kid. You're he is a theater right. kid. He's an He's old school. Kid. Yeah, yeah. He, is, like a he, made, he also, also, also he made that jacket. <laughs> Everything on that jacket he yeah. did. For sure. <laughs> yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, he owns Capri pants. Um, without question. Yeah, without a doubt. Go ahead. You can play it now. You guys all have someone in mind? Yeah. Your mom. Boo! <laughs> Boo! <laughs> and then, and then, and then, dude, all four of them lay on their buzzers after that. <laughs> Everybody have somebody in mind? Yeah, your mom. <laughs> <laughs> get the fuck out of here, dude. We're sick of hearing your sad stories. <laughs> Suck our Good. pigs. Yeah, get Which your kids. Your kids haven't shut up in the fucking back. Your adopted hey, kids. Watch. Hey, why don't you go check the? Why don't you go watch the nine forty five in the Heights? You fucking fool! <laughs> we need to do the a- AGT takeover. You got the AGT bonfire takeover. Just, just maraud it. Just come in like raiders. Oh, I fucking love that. Your mom. Yeah. And, and, yeah. And, and, and. You're, just, you're just holding Howie Mandel's aye, uh, aye, severed aye. head. Your this stories. is our show now. Dude, Your stories dr- keep going on and on. Just dress like pirates. Just dress like pirates. And then you got <laughs> Jacob. Jacob has Heidi sitting on his knee. And he goes, what'd you oh, think God, of that? Dude. What'd you think of that? And she goes, I liked it. He goes, no, you didn't like it. She goes, I did not like it. Oh, do it. Let's storm, let's storm in like the bad guys in Weird Science, remember? <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah, dude. We'll take over that house party. You just come in like microphone. I have a sawed-off shotgun with feathers on it. <laughs> hey, go Ow. ahead, Dustin. Do your stupid bit. Of all of those markers in front of you, what color do you feel best represents the person that you're thinking of? Pink for how gay your that? mom is. Purple. Uh, purple? Can you please pass that purple <laughs> marker over to Sophia? Purple, because no. your mom's Over. a royal. S- purple, because your mom's a royal Sophia slut. And- <laughs> <laughs> she goes. Do I sniff it? Post- she has no idea. By the way, she does. She doesn't have to write anything, but she already takes the cap off the marker. She's wow. always so puzzled by everything. <laughs> Cards from places around the world that are on our bucket list. I want you to select the one that you think may connect best with the person you have in your mind. What? And Anyone? Do I write something on it? Um, no, that's going to be for Heidi. Oh. But see, you're the magician. You already know what's coming. Okay. What? She has no mm. clue what's going on. Ever. Dude, I, you can it was funny. Is there's a, there's a moment right there where he kind of loses his shit. He goes, well, yeah, yeah. I didn't say write it, did I? You fucking. Do I I goes, no, no, that's for later. But I have to, and she and she even goes, she like shakes when it happens. Goes, I, things happen. I no no. 
Dude, you know what's funny? Sankara did, I'm not even fucking with you, a version of this trick. <laughs> <laughs> he That's asked people to pick a city. Buddy. To, no joke. This is Sankara. Dude, this guy's doing Sankara shit. We got to tell straight him, up, dude. Straight up Sankara. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, also, every bit he does, this is like, whatever the trick is for this is a kind of bit. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like it's right. like if every comic goes up there every week, it was just like the same like misdirection joke. Like one time totally, it's your mom, totally. another time it's your best friend, whatever. Right, it's all right, this is. Right. Everyone is like, you guys randomly select things, and it's like, oh, look at how it ties into the day we adopted these kids and all that shit. Yeah. So you'll see, yeah. yeah. Good. <laughs> oh my fuck! Make big? everything difficult. Why don't Venice. you? Venice, Venice, awesome. Can you please pass Venice over to Heidi as well? Okay, cut. There. <laughs> you guys are amazing. You guys are great. So, you guys um, are amazing. Heidi, when, when... <laughs> you guys are so amazing. You guys want to? Can you guys kiss? He starts getting creepy. <laughs> How about you guys? You guys want to touch each other? A he little goes. Bit? Now, which now, part of your fit. pussy reminds you of your grandfather the most? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like... Now you should be favorite. Lean over there and just give her a good old, just maybe a real open mouther right there on the table, <laughs> on the stage. Do you guys, um, have you guys ever seen Wild Things with Nev Campbell and Denise Richards? <laughs> maybe a little of that. <laughs> this next answer right here is the reason why. I mean, obviously, it's not real magic, but why I think the judges are in on it completely. Mm. Okay. But go ahead, because this one here. Because this is life. Yeah. at a left What's field. a word that comes to mind? I write it on you? Yeah, yeah. What's the word? Curious. Curious? Yeah, write that real big on the back. Judge, and know, With Simon's marker. Yeah, that. perfect. Is she talking about her cat or her children? <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Her cat. And I'm actually going to take that from you. <laughs> and um, it, that's the up, most Howie. Right. Of all of these envelopes, which one do you feel best represents the person you're thinking of? I'm colorblind. Are you? That's so funny. <laughs> That's a terrible That's idea. That's so funny. That's so funny. That's so fucking funny. <laughs> it's colored envelopes, and he's like, which one? He's like, dude, I don't know. I see black and white like a dog. <laughs> Howie, which one, one of these shampoos he goes, would you he goes, rather use the most? He goes, okay, okay, so you weren't blessed by God to see his rainbow? Okay. Okay, but okay. there's probably something else. Like you probably smell real good, right? <laughs> okay, okay, you hate germs. I forgot. You were a real fucking weirdo. <laughs> Shout out That's Sonic now, with those fucking giant thermoses. Send us some now, of those. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and lick your hands, Howie Mandel. Don't make it weird. <laughs> Yo, oh, we're my gonna man's bump got an Apple Watch, too. Look yeah, at that. Take your <laughs> shirt off. We're going to bump tummies. <laughs> Yo, I'm going to go back to my 10,000 steps now, if you don't mind. <laughs> boop, boop. Oh, I just hit a fitness goal. <laughs> see, 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 Ooh, see, I just see. hit a fitness goal. This <laughs> moonwalks. <laughs> Go ahead, play it. <laughs> That's a great surprise. By the way, Howie Mandel, everybody. <laughs> He's got coke now. He's colorblind. So, before I put this postcard into this envelope. Terry Crews, can you please join me on stage? <laughs> Give it up for Terry Crews. What? We got Terry Crews on deck. He's dressed like Come an on, Oscar. Terry. He's the host. Hey, Terry, I'm going to have you tear off a corner of this postcard, okay? But don't just make it like a straight tear. Make it somewhat unique. By the way, pause it. Because without, without, without his story, without his story involved in this, this trick is done by pretty much every magician ripped this off, and now yeah. I find the part that I had is somewhere where it couldn't have been. And is it match up to the piece you ripped off? I mean, every right. magician. 100%. This thing. <laughs> I'm out Man. on this guy. Let's fuck him up. But listen, how much all this time, all the time wasted is. You don't think he doesn't know low level capoeira? You're wrong. Yeah. <laughs> You're right, dude. Oh, he, and he, he, he says things like he dedicated his life to something. He prices about a lot of things. I dedicated my life to archery for a few years. <laughs> and that's when I'm like, oh, Christ almighty. That's when I learned that I, I was me through the bow. Yeah. <laughs> As something like a receipt. Oh, he's getting it. Yeah. Perfect. Yep. He goes, oh, this. okay. I see you there tearing that. Yeah. Well, I'll <laughs> show you this. I'll show you where the switcheroo is, by the way. Mm. Damn. Shit. 
Yeah, all right. Yeah, I didn't Beyond. know. You, I didn't know you were in on that. You were like a fucking magic conspiracy guy. <laughs> yeah, dude, uh, he's, an expo- he's an exposer. <laughs> yeah, he, oh, here's my pro- guy on you. Remember on UPN they would. I do. That guy yeah, the, the, the mask. <laughs> yeah, the, the the mask magician. Yeah, I would. Uh, hell yeah. No, I'm not like that. What I watch for it on TV is because, especially if you're doing like this, if the whole thing's explained as like. It was already handled. You know what I mean? Like it's always like right. They're, it's, of course, they're, they're not destroying the thing. If if there's no way to make it look, I mean, there's some magicians who do shit now that you can't. It, it's like I don't know how the fuck they're possibly doing that at all. Yeah. But if it, if the answer of this long fucking story is the old switcheroo, which is all it <laughs> yeah, is, which it's pretty lame. Is what it is. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. lame. I'm with and it's you. All, and it's all just him going like my wife and the way she cared about me and my. Uh, she used to yeah. wipe my butt when I would poop, even when I didn't ask. The only thing that would be inex- inexplicable <laughs> magic. I love the only that. thing that would be inexplicable magic would be if he actually burns this envelope that has this. That. Thing. Now, that, now that's the actual thing right there he's putting in. Mm-hmm. Let's Go see ahead. it. Just hold on to that corner for now. Okay. Now, judges, look. Why is his mouth? You so guys dry? collectively. I, made I'm telling you, he's got coke mouth. That- <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he really does. <laughs> he goes, hey, anyways, that, you guys, uh, that freeze you guys got a bottle of water Man, or anything? You can't freeze frame him where you don't think he's fucking judging the shit out of you. <laughs> yeah. he just, he, he's really like, bro, you should probably exercise more and smoke less. Hey, bro, yeah. you got a lot of salt in your diet. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed you're eating bread after five. <laughs> <laughs> People who have impacted each of your lives. Unfortunately, sometimes we can become so consumed oh, with shit. life that we can start to take for granted the people. Yeah, he. Uh, the, who've I'm sorry, I should have pointed out for us, but when they went off of him on camera, is when he did that mm, switch. He's switching. He's switcherooing. Oh, brutal, brutal. I truly hate this guy. There's not much. The problem is there's not much like analysis to do other than I would like this guy to get the shit kicked out of him. You know, I'm just anti him in every way, shape and form. Here's where I'm not. <clears throat> I'm not as anti him as I, I'm about to be anti the judges reactions. OK. All right. All right. I'll wait for it. And we can start to function as if they're not even there. What? Terry, can you please do something? Can you name one of the judges Fuck for off. me? Heidi. Heidi. <laughs> Can we do something we've never done before? Can we the bring kiss? down Heidi's ex? <laughs> yeah. oh. Oh. It crushes oh, her. Oh, 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 oh no! Oh god! Seal comes down. He, oh he, 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 no! He just yeah. <laughs> Seal repelling down would be such a better ending to whatever the, whatever the fuck he's about to do right now. To time, but... <laughs> yeah, what happened, dog? Jay. Hey, everybody hear me? <laughs> yeah. Hey, Jay. My codex shit the bed. Uh, you did miss Stavros' home run where he said, let's bring down Heidi's ex, and he said, it's just Seal. <laughs> <laughs> just seal repelling down. Oh, by the way, <laughs> just so you know, that's uh, you're about to hear... Uh oh. Uh, what's her name? Make the same. She goes. I thought they made oh, your no. ex husband. Wow. Damn, wow. dude. You and Stavros, you and Sofia Vergara are supposed to be together. Same I'm about to text level. her, dude. I'm about to hit her up. You're like, yo, what's up? What's up, luscious babe? There's a, that's in the magic. There's a brain to titty link going on there. I, I, that's that's how I've trained myself to think the way big titted ladies think. Yeah. <laughs> so we're both gonna do it the same, you know. <laughs> you're, you're the big titty hunter. They bring you I'm in. Big titty like, hunter. That's right. <laughs> you know, I know how they think. I know how they are. I, I know how they operate. Think like them. <laughs> you just you just rub your lower back for the pain, and then you're like, I can get into her mind. I I'm gonna give you. A, <laughs> I'm gonna give you a half spoiler alert. Uh oh. Yeah. To tell you that. You know, it's obviously like the envelope's going to be in that X is the big reveal. But oh, dude, watch how he pulls what it the out. Hell, all right, let's see it. And he pulls it out. It's like clearly didn't have to be in there at all. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, like why? So it looks like he's in pain, dude. It looks like he's in fucking pain. 
He's like, coughing. Oh, his oh, mouth is dry. He like has like tuberculosis. It's like it's kind of disease we cured like a hundred years ago. I'll tell you why. Holiday, he wants to get out of a bed and do it. He's like, oh, yeah, I'll be all for it. I'll tell you why. Heidi Klum and uh, Sofia Vergara are the two stupidest people he's ever performed in front of, and they have microphones. <laughs> they have microphones during a set. <laughs> yeah. It's like giving seven-year-old microphones while you're trying to watch The Godfather. They're not going to get it. They're just going to say things about other stuff. <laughs> I don't know why he is a marker for who right was. Is that a ghost marker? <laughs> <Big> city. <laughs> Oh, fuck. All right. Let's see. I'm ready. I'm ready for the grand finale. Two X's. Try to throw it in there. They don't get it. So, look, having people like this in our lives is super valuable because these people, they see see who we are, and they give us grace when we need it. And this is exactly yeah. This is like what Carrie this is seriously like me. when a comic does has a bunch of jokes about stuff, but tries to put it under a bigger theme. <laughs> right. Like, this is yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think this yeah. is Carrie, dude. Really? That doesn't it's, make much in sense. In many ways, in many ways, what our country is up against is a lot like when your dick can't get hard. <laughs> and uh, recently, my dick couldn't get. Hard. <laughs> like, like, That's like, great. You guys <laughs> ever had that? <laughs> yeah, God, that ever this feels more guys. to me like when a comic. Uh, proposes to his chick at the end of his set one time. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. That, I saw that in D.C. one time. It was Oh, my fuck. It was horrible. Goes, it was just... He goes, and then and then uh, I was like, well, I just came, so we're going to have to make plans a different night. <laughs> Seriously, though, guys, thank you so much. Before I get out of here, I have to call the love of my life up to the stage. <laughs> uh, he loves me. She forgives, and she makes me Forgives. That was big. Why? And when we have forgives? someone like this, of course, it was, of course. <laughs> Why is Just, I don't think it'll be cheats. I think this morning she was like, "Well, Dustin, I found coke in your pocket when I was doing laundry today on show day. Really, <laughs> on show fucking day. You said you were gonna get us out of this dump." You, you know the these baby fucking kids. You want these you know fucking the, kids I adopted for you. <laughs> you know the baby's sick. I gotta take her her all day, and you're out there doing blow with your magician assistants. Yeah, you're fucking yelling Alakazam in the garage while you're doing <laughs> you're banging rails. I'm in you're here banging. feeding two kids that aren't even mine. <laughs> Our lot. Making, making, making a rail disappear and yelling ta-da has to be very fun. When you're, when you're, when you're uh, I'm practicing uh, in here, babe. Come on. Uh, me when the magic's flowing. <laughs> she forgives and she makes me better. And when we have someone like this in our lives, when it's real, their words and their impact, they become a part of us. You hear every lick of his mouth, by the and way. And because Brutal, they dude. become a part of us, uh, they're uh, always look, look, there with us. Oh, the, the envelopes anywhere. Even are you fucking kidding? When we seemingly no. forgot about them. <laughs> now look, this is only impressive. If this really is the postcard that you guys just it's made not that impressive. a moment ago, it's not, just it's you not. obviously didn't burn the other one. <laughs> this isn't a good trick. <laughs> no, listen. Can I tell you something? What's his face used to tell a stranger to write uh, someone's name on a piece of paper and he would set it on fire and then rub it on his fucking arm and the name would appear and fucking ash and razor blade scars and it was crazy. Yeah. That was. That was fucking awesome. This is the old. <laughs> yeah. You thought I burned that thing, but it was at my. Zoom. It was a thing. Uh, Z- I probably, in this, when you uh, probably in this unnecessary jacket I was wearing. <laughs> what if I told you I was zigging when you were zagging and zagging when you were zigging? <laughs> when you guys were paying attention to Terry Crews, I was up to some sinister activity. <laughs> 80 years ago, he would have had a, a twirly mustache and he would have been like, oh, yeah. <laughs> His dildo villain. He oh, still yeah. wants oh. one. Yeah, <laughs> he even has the face card. Don't you understand that merely magic is misplacement? <laughs> vanilla ice, the vanilla ice eyebrow is the new doom, doom, twirly doom, mustache. Doom, doom, doom. Absolutely. Doom, 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 doom. Now mine goes. Doom, doom, That's doom, Sophia chose. No. Uh, oh wow! With Heidi's word on the back. Like he's having a Rain female orgasm during his words. It's always like. And Terry, can you come up here? Because this becomes so, absolutely impossible if that corner that you're holding oh. really is the missing piece of this postcard. Terry, 
Can you please make sure Wait, that is an exact match? Here, I'm going to skip match. ahead only because I think so. it, it matches. You get it. Yeah, yeah. There, yeah. There's, there's one last thing. We only hey, have a minute babe, left. I love you this is from his wife. I believe in you, but please just know that even if Simon doesn't pick the purple you marker. No! <laughs> and even if Sophia doesn't choose Venice. Uh-huh. Are you kidding what? me? Uh-huh. And even if oh, Heidi doesn't say curious. curious. Wow. Mm-hmm. Wow. And even if Howie doesn't pick the green it envelope. Green? It was green, yeah. <laughs> Funniest thing that show's ever said. <laughs> that's the best, yeah, that's great. Fuck <laughs> yes. We will know always have fu- each other. Oh, get and so we've already it. won. Boo. 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 Fuck you. It would have been funnier <laughs> if he would have gone, yeah, and I also fucked your brother Mark. That's the trick. He goes, oh, oh. go to stabby.biz. Mag- goes fucking gay and I sucked your brother off. <laughs> 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 go see. Go see. <laughs>